Have you ever had anybody not show up to a job interview or not answer your text or phone call? Well, you know, uh, a lot of people think that that's a common occurrence today, and it's called ghosting. Uh, if that's ever happened to you, you've been ghosted. Uh, you know, and the funny thing is, is that it's not nothing new. In fact, ghosting uh, has been around for a very long time. Uh, the, you know, employers have been doing it for forever. Uh, have you ever went to a, uh, and filled out a job application uh, never to hear anything about the, about the job? Uh, you, you've been ghosted as, a, as an applicant. So the, the employers have been doing it forever. And uh, now there just seems to be people that really have noticed it that uh, when they're setting an appointment for an interview for an applicant, they're not showing up um, and or returning their phone calls or text. Well, I think fair play is, is fair. So, you know, and I can remember, boy, I think it's been 40 years ago when I ghosted my first employer. So, uh, this here was a lumber yard, and I uh, accepted a job, showed up, worked a half a day, and it just wasn't, it just wasn't for me. Um, I didn't think I wanted to have a career stacking, stacking lumber. Uh, lunchtime came, and I never returned, so I ghosted them. Okay, <laughs> then uh, my the second time I ghosted my employer was uh, I was on a construction site, and uh, I decided to ghost them because the supervisor was just a real, real pain in the butt. Uh, they were just uh, they were they were a horrible supervisor. Let me put it that way, uh, and so I did the same thing there. Uh, when lunch when lunch time came, I just uh, I never came back. So I ghosted them because the they didn't know how to treat their employees. Um, I actually had a third time. The third time uh, and the last time I did that uh, that I ghosted uh, an employer was uh, again. Uh, this was a, a job where I was building pole barns and sheds and things like that, um, and. This, uh, this supervisor, he was a real piece of work. Um, you know, he, uh, he didn't know how to treat the people. Uh, he didn't treat anybody with any respect. And um, in fact, there was uh, myself and uh, three other people that were on, on his crew. And um, we had one person on there that was just, they are just lazy. Uh, they were never to work on time. Uh, in fact, uh, the day that I that I ghosted them was the day that uh, that my supervisor said we had to go by the jail to pick up this this person, and and then uh, then he promotes them to a lead person. Uh, so when we stopped to get supplies, they went in. I got out of the truck and walked all the way back to my to my vehicle that was probably about four miles away. Great summer day. Uh, just took my time, enjoyed it and uh, never went back to work for them again. Um, but anyway, my whole point is that ghosting has been around for a long time. Uh, in fact, you've probably done it or had it done to you. So I'd really like you to, in the comment section below, go ahead and tell us your story. When was the last time you were ghosted or when did you ghost somebody else? Well, until next time, I'm Steve Hansen. I'm co-founder of the janitorial store in my house cleaning biz.